hello all this is Tarun uh, today I am going to show you how to use um, separate dot nuke for uh, nuke 12 as well as for nuke 13 this is the only folder the nuke get access before the nuke gets launched it will look for the files in dot uh, nuke folder okay the problem here I am facing is uh, I have a lot of my own scripts um, which I am using in which I use which I am using for uh, to set the default project setting and to and for also uh, render multiple write nodes here these scripts I have written in Python 2 so it will not work in uh, it will not work in uh, Nuke 13 it will works only in uh, Nuke 12 okay let me show you a demo what actually happening here I am launching Nuke 12 okay um, now it's get launched uh, when I launch the Nuke 12 um, see I am launching uh, Nuke 12 see it's working fine with uh, all my scripts um with all my scripts and all um I, and also i have set uh, the default project setting to 2k uh, it also it's working fine here but see uh, what happens when i launch nuke 13 here See when nuke 13 gets launched, uh, it's showing the error in uh, menu.py uh, because I have the, some scripts written in Python 2. That's why it's showing the error. Um, okay, I'm hitting OK. Okay, I'm going to dot nuke folder. Windows R dot nuke. Hit OK. See, this is my not dot nuke folder. Uh, I have my uh, entire uh, gizmos and scripts and also as well as tools for um, nuke 12. Actually, I think you uh, you will not face any error with the gizmos. You will face the error uh, only with the Python scripts. Okay. Uh, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm selecting all. I'm cut. I'm creating the new folder as new underscore twelve, and I am pasting all here. Uh, in dot nuke folder I have created a folder called a nuke underscore 12 here I have copied this uh, all my scripts and gizmos to this folder okay actually I'm going to use this uh, for nuke 12 and also I'm going to create uh, one more folder as nuke 13 okay uh, this is the folder which I'm, which I'm going to use it for uh, nuke 13 actually you can use all these scripts in um, actually you can use all these uh, scripts in nuke 13 uh, but the, but you have to rewrite or update your codes to um, python 3 uh, yeah we can do that uh, but it'll, it'll take some time and also uh, if you download any scripts from Wikipedia, probably they may also uh, build with python 2 so it might not be working in uh, nuke 13 okay okay i'm getting back here i'm going to create a new text document as um, init.py Here I am going to add some lines here. Um, if new dot new underscore version underscore major less than or equal to 12 1 2 3 4 new sorry new dot plugin add path new underscore 12 Okay, let's check this script. Okay, uh, it's working fine. I'm going to close this new. <coughs> Else, I'm copying this line and I'm pasting this. And I'm pasting here and I'm changing this to new 13. 
actually what the script doing is if the version of the nuke is equal to 12 it means uh, nuke 12 or 10 11 something like that it will look for the files uh, gizmos and plugins and also scripts in in this nuke underscore 12 folder or else it will look for the path and files in um, nuke 13 okay uh, i hope you understand this uh, okay i am okay i have saved this script and i'm closing this now i'm launching nuke 12 See, new tool is working fine um, also it's um, all my scripts also working fine here I am closing this and I am launching new 13 here Um, see nuke 13 also have launched uh, without any errors before we have made a separate folder for uh, nuke 12 and 13 it will show you um, it will show the error uh, while launching nuke 13 but now um, it's working fine then also uh, I will show you a small demo um, um, in nuke 12 folder um, you have all your uh, menu.py uh, menu.py uh, as well as uh, init.py okay in menu.py what i'm going to do is uh, i have I, i'm going to write uh, a um, single line uh, as new dot message you are in new i'm copying this and i'm closing this and in new 13 I'm going to create a new text document as menu.py here I'm pasting this and here I'm going to uh, rename it 12 as 13 because this is the look at this folder is uh, set to uh, new 13 I'm launching nuke 12 before uh, once it gets launched it will show you pop-up as uh, you are in nuke 12 uh, see it's showing that you are in nuke 12 uh, when you hit ok it will open you the uh, user interface for nuke 12 okay I'm going to launch uh, nuke 13 also it will show you the uh, pop-up here as you are in nuke 13 See here it's showing as uh, you are in nuke 13 and hit ok it will launch the uh, user interface for nuke 13 okay see we are in nuke 13 okay i'm going to the dot nuke folder again see here you have now two preferences for for nuke 12 and this for nuke 13 the reason why i am writing in init.py is first you you should know the difference between init.py and uh, menu.py actually init.py will get accessed before the nukes get launched and the menu.py will get accessed after the nukes get launched so that's why i am using init.py here uh, so what i did here is before nuke gets launched i am checking here uh, if the nuke is equal less than or equal to 12 it will look for the files in nuke 12 if not it will look for the files in nuke 13 it is a simple um this is a simple script Okay, and also uh, let me show you uh, why I'm using the nuke 13. Actually, for using the copycat node, um, I'm using the nuke 13. Okay, uh, I hope this video will uh, definitely helpful for the artists, those who are uh, switching from uh, nuke 12 to nuke 13. Um, okay, that's all. Thanks for watching.